Well, businesses and commuters are cheering this week with the reopening of East First Avenue this Friday. The busy thoroughfare has been subject to lane closures since late May due to gas line installations. But as David Zura has found, some businesses say it may be too late. Getting around Vancouver this summer has been a tough task, especially with East First being completely shut down in many parts as it still remains and Lougheed Highway also under construction. Now, that's because Fortis, B.C. is rebuilding a natural gas line and that project goes through Vancouver to Burnaby, right into Coquitlam, and that's caused the closures here. Now, right now, East First is closed between Clark all the way down to Nanaimo. That then the, beyond that, we've got partial lane closures with one in each direction. Now, some good news is later on this week by Friday, we're expecting these areas of East First to reopen. However, businesses are saying the construction has already taken too big of a bite by pushing patrons away. The owner of Cassia Bake Shop says she had to close the doors and let go of staff until September after realizing she was just averaging six customers per day. Yeah, we now it's very hard to hire a new employee because uh, um, I can't just open business uh, and hire them. I need to train them. But without the business open, I can't train. And people were avoiding this area like the plague. They actually told me customers that said they wanted to come to my restaurant, but said they, they didn't want to because they wanted to avoid the chaos of trying to get here with this First Avenue closure. Now, although First Avenue is scheduled to reopen this week, drivers can expect the gas line work on Lougheed Highway to continue right into October. Now, that's in the area by Willingdon. Over there, we're seeing closures with one lane in each direction, which is causing some severe traffic backups through most periods of the day. Drivers are being told to either pick a different route or allow more time for their commute. In Vancouver, David Zura, City News.